all right welcome back everybody to the channel you already know what it is so today's video we got two or three two or three packages yo i said two or three packages So about three packages and turn off that light right there behind you. But anyways, uh, right now what we're gonna do is, as you remember in the old clips that I had, this car has been having the OEM one. I tried to sand them down and everything. They were just kind of trash, but I knew I was gonna get eventually some new ones. Uh, so that is today's video. We have finally got some brand new headlights. Uh, my brother's going to, he already installed them before, but we had to seal them up because you know, they fog up and that's what happened the first day literally the first day uh it fogged up that same night so he sealed them uh i think they're sealed now and then he got the new balance and then the side markers uh, somewhere in here you can see these are the new headlights we just took them out of the package this is that and then the help the side markers because the ones we had were kind of trash this is a new one, a little blackout. So, I don't remember what I looked at. Hey, this is the old one. See, retard. Look at that. Crazy. It was just be something. Full BS stuff, you know? Some retarded shit. But, that's that. Get rid of those this two video started and what we're doing right here is what we're gonna do here Tommy the new ballast. so he was saying that it wasn't uh, I'm assuming from there you can see that it's not flat anyway these are the new ones that we ordered the new ballast should be able to Anyways, while he does that Let's talk about update. So the update on the G is we're about one or two months away before having everything we need. We can technically boost it. We just need to pay for it. We just need to pay for the tune, which is of course from Z1. And uh, well, I already think I got a person to install the kit. I would do it, but I'm not trying to mess up nothing and you know have headaches with it. I'm trying to get this done uh, properly, also. But I just really need an oil cooler, uh, you know, this is big for the VQ, an uh, oil cooler, and uh, the tires from the back, but well, ain't too important, but you know, still, that's what I bought the welds for, but the oil cooler, and probably a radiator fan just to keep temps uh, down, a couple gauges, like the air fuel ratio gauge, uh, what else? the boost gauge, etc. And once that's done, I'm probably, I don't know yet, we're trying to hit 500 is the main goal, but, you know, stock the E, you know, I'm trying to make it last until we get the bottom end built for, from RZG, which is like a 1200 uh, HP uh, bottom end, rated bottom end, and I'll just need to get some hand uh, heads in there, probably throw some cams, springs and retainer, and we'll be technically almost a fully built motor, but, you know, partially in there and not. Then I just gotta save up some money to get the CD009. And then I'll rock with that for a minute if I sell the Vortex. Sell the Vortex Supercharger, go turbo, and get more mods. But like I said, stock stock plan 400 to 500. I'm trying to make it last, but one or two months this thing should be done. Um, I'm gonna get a I'm gonna replace this one with the bar because I do have the fat intercooler and I want people to see it, you know? And I'm gonna get a, a brand new, my dog's eating the house. He's eating the house. I'll sell this bumper right here and probably buy a new one, get it painted, etc., and get new wheels right here. Well, like I said, all that is gonna be done after we boost it. The boosting part is gonna be the most important part for this build right now. You know, so hopefully it lasts about a year plus. It should give us enough time to save up some money to buy everything we need. Um, but yeah, this car is coming along finally after one year of owning it. 
we're doing modifications to it. So we've been spending money, so much money on everything to boost it. And we, I literally, if I show you, and then I'll probably throw a clip in. I have a car, spare car, full parts for the G, like full, full, you know? And that's what we've been doing, like waiting and waiting and gathering parts. So once we boost it, once we're installing everything, we can throw everything on that we bought. But, but yeah, that is why this kit's looking ugly and I really haven't made too many videos of it just because we haven't installed parts to it. But the, yeah, the channel is mainly going to be focusing on the G once it's done. A lot of y'all have more G35s and stuff like that. And I'm assuming y'all like to see more content. And I would definitely like to get some uh, new GoPros and strap it on to see what a 500 horsepower G35 or even a 400 horsepower G35 partially gutted can do again some V8s or something or some little faster cars you can see no seats. we got to clean that up the trunk there's nothing in the trunk Tom pop the trunk I have nothing in the trunk other than the garbage but you know I got to take these little things off and I'm gonna probably paint it black inside and yeah not too sure what I'm gonna do with these two keep the same uh, setup or not but probably gonna go to a single to be honest but yeah and for those don't mind my life jacket but yeah I got tired but anyway this is everything I got I took some little parts in there just to get some room in here but anyway I got everything extra parts brimble brakes might be selling the rear might keep them I don't know yet because if the car's gonna be into sh uh, shows, I might upgrade, sell my drag pack for the rear and up it to a 17, that way I can fit them. But I really like the style of 15 inch. Got the wells right here, new radiator, the Vortex kit. All right, everybody, so this is the light right here. We're testing them something because my brother ordered a new ballast and there's supposed to be something right here where a little thing, okay, that, let me see, go ahead. Yeah, that. The little strip is on, yeah. Bottom's on. Okay. The wire don't work. Huh? That wire don't work. No? So I'm gonna just return it. Alright, so that was the issue that that the ballast. The ballast or the new this That's piece? the new harness for the Okay, the yeah, but I'm saying which one didn't work? The, the this this don't work. They don't have I don't know yeah. the ground for it. Alright, so like he was saying, so the part says it was fit the G thirty five, but it didn't. But now that we're on here with the headlights, these are the Aspect D headlights. My brother will give you more information. What are they? Aspect D headlights? <laughs> yeah, but uh, what are these though? No, that's the tank signal sequential and then the tank signal. My ballast works out. These are my fog lights. This is the projector. The HID. But the, this is working. So this is not working currently. So the top one doesn't work at all because. The, the old ones of these don't work, but we had to order a new ones with the ballast and there's a missing piece where it's supposed to be in there, but it doesn't, it didn't bring it. So we we're gonna have to return it, but welcome back everybody. It's been about two weeks plus we have made a video, but today I'm just gonna do a couple updates before I do like another review or product review. So keep you posted up with the G. I got the headlights. I had the side markers, but if you have a G35, then you can relate. That the side markers will fall if you don't put a song. We really had to learn that the hard way. Brand new ones, nice smoke ones. Lost it about within a week. Uh, these are the Spec D headlights right here. My brother was able to cop them for a fair price. Then he sealed them. He still has to put. I don't remember if he had. Maybe I still have the video where we were doing the installation of the video of the lights and stuff, and we had to like. Uh, I don't even remember what it's called, but he had the thing to it and it didn't fit so he finally got that in and that sealed that up looks very nice man. so yeah that looks really nice i'm just gonna try to get a picture of that throw that in but yeah so that is that Super close, got the up rev, which I was showing in the video. I got an up rev uh, cable to buy my license to tune it. 
So when I go to get it to him from Z1. So yeah, other than that, same old stuff. So small times, especially with uh, the coronavirus, it's really slow at work, which slows down the workflow. But I do gotta show you what I, I bought, but anyway.